Hello everyone, welcome back to another quick AI video. This one I'm going to show you how to edit images using Dolly 3 and this is the updated version that has the new select option and the brushes. Here's an example. Here's a French Bulldog that I got, uh, you know, big smile with a surprised face, looks good. Then I changed the color of its eyes to blue as you can see here, it looks like a White Walker <laughs> from Game of Thrones and then I added in a Snoopy propeller hat. How did I do all that? Super easy. Should take about 60 to 90 seconds. Let me show you. All right, so the first step is you wanna go into chat GPT-4. I will put a link in the description below. And then here in the prompt, just type in what you want. I want um, Pixar style English, English Bulldog with a happy face, something like that. Just nice and simple. And then I'm gonna go ahead and click on that little arrow. I'll come back when it's done. I'll show you the next step. All right, so here's an example of a Pixar style English Bulldog. It's kind of weird looking. It's got a bit of a pumpkin jowl on it, but hey, let's go with it. I'm going to click on it. And when I do that up here at the top, you're going to see the select feature. This is new. This is brand new. I believe it launched today. So when I click on select, now it turns into a brush. When I hover over it, you'll see here that this looks kind of like a Photoshop brush, but a circular brush only. Now at the top left here, I can go ahead and increase and decrease the size of that circle. So in this case, I'm gonna make it this size, and then I'm just gonna go ahead and paint over the eye like this. So basically what I'm doing is I'm just kind of going in and editing. There's two things you can do. You can edit the image, and then you can also add to an image. So in this case, I'm just gonna edit it, and then here I'm gonna make the eyes blue, something like that. And then I'm going to go ahead and hit enter. It's gonna think about this. There we go, it's creating the image. I'll come back when it's done, show you the results. All right, so it came back and it kind of gave me an icy blue, which I'll take, I mean, it's not so bad. But there you go, that is the first step. Now I'm gonna go ahead and click on this select button again, and I'm going to add to it. So in this case, I'm gonna go ahead and add, I don't know, what. It, let's put something on his head here. So I'm gonna go ahead and put in a, um, I don't know, let's just go ahead and add a hat. So I'm just gonna type in add hat. And then I'm gonna go ahead and hit enter. And then it's going to go ahead and rethink about this. Now keep in mind that there's not a lot of space up here, so we might only get part of the hat, but the technique is all I wanna show you. So there you go. I'll come back when it's done and then I'll show you the final step. All right, we've got a cool blue and red party hat on his head. I like that one. So that looks pretty damn good. The last thing I wanna mention here is you can download the or save the image or download it here. But look at this. If I click on the prompt, this will give you the exact prompt that was used to generate this revised image. So keep that in mind. If you ever wanna reuse this, you can just copy it and use it. But there you go. This is the new functionality in Dolly 3 for editing and adjusting and adding to images. Thanks for watching.